How did Bluey's parents survive as prisoners of war under the brutal Japanese regime? In 1942, the Shibuist Japanese military occupation reached its zenith, occupying most of Asia under its rule. Australian Prime Minister John Curtin, seeing the dire situation Australia was put in, brought Australian troops away from the fight in Europe to defend their home. Declaring the existence of a state of war with Japan. Both of Bluey's parents served in the Pacific Theatre under Curtin's leadership. Petty Officer Bandit was attempting to defend the remains of the Dutch East Indies aboard the HMAS Perth Light Cruiser, and Auxiliary Nurse Chili served the supposedly impregnable Singapore. The captain of the HMAS Perth, Anthony Rusty Waller, was part of a ragtag four-nation fleet that was tasked with intercepting a Japanese Navy force in the Java Sea. But the superior Japanese Navy crushed the fleet, destroying all the Dutch cruisers and all destroyers, with only the USS Houston and HMAS Perth able to break off the fight, they sailed to Tanjung Priok to refuel. The HMAS Perth was sunk only two days later when facing off against the Japanese invasion force in Western Java. After somehow taking only superficial damage in spite of being surrounded by the enemy fleet, Petty Officer Bandit banned the guns until the ship was low on ammunition, in which Captain Rusty Waller prepared to force passage through the Sunder Strait, but was hit by multiple torpedoes and at 12.25am on the 1st of March 1942 sunk to the deep death, with the USS Houston shortly afterwards. Rusty, as the captain, decided to go down with this ship, but before it sank, he ordered Bandit to protect the ship's beloved ratta, Jemima. Barely able to make it onto the raft with the greatly shell-shocked plush toy, Bandit was one of few survivors to drift to a nearby island, where he was able to meet up with nearby survivors of the sunken ships, including Houston's only surviving cook, Darwin Watterson, but were captured shortly after and sent to work on the Thai Burma Railway. The conditions on the Thai Burma Railway were appalling. With starvation and constant malaria the norm, these men had to work constantly, lugging massive sleepers through rocky jungle, many would die under those conditions. Of the 686 crewmates of the HMAS Perth, only 218 made it back home, of which Bandit was one of them. After the fall of Singapore, Bluey's mother, Chili, was marched into Changi Prison along with 500 other female detainees, where they were made to sew quilts for the prison hospitals. Chili was one of the women who risked severe punishment by embroidering symbols of home onto the quilts. Some of those symbols included scenes from her hometown of Brisbane, Queensland, and even the names of her lover at the time, Bandit, followed by the name of her child, which she kept hidden when she enrolled, and would later lose due to severe malnutrition she underwent as a prisoner of war. Both Petty Officer Bandit and Auxiliary Nurse Chili were safely repatriated home after the end of the Second World War. Although they raised a peaceful family together, the horrors of war were always inside of them.